Well, a very warm and a very festive hello across internet land. Hello, biking buddies. You know what the difference is between you and me? I make this look good. Are you ready? We're off out for a pre-Christmas jaunt. You would never believe that we're less than a handful of sleeps away from Christmas. It's a beautiful day. Temperature is plus 10 degrees, which is just outstandingly warm for the UK this time of year. And we've got a group of us in tow. Riding with my neighbour again, Matty. Always good to have him out with us. Speedy Joe, she's with us again. Can't keep a good biker down. So uh, yeah, we're heading out, enjoying some more of this unseasonally warm weather that we seem to be bathing in in the UK at the moment, which is absolutely fantastic, superb for biking. The warm weather obviously has meant that uh, the gritters have been kept at bay, so in truth, with the exception that there are no leaves on the trees and the sun's a little bit low in the sky, uh, this is just like riding in an early summer's day. We're cruising in company today, which is nice. There's, uh, I think, there's about six of us out today, which is brilliant. But well, the nice thing about this road is, uh, you know, you can just ride it, ride it at a reasonable pace. Well, why was she flashing her lights? Is that I mean there's a police van down here, camera van, which wouldn't surprise me? An accident, perhaps? something so this is the beautiful North Yorkshire TT road and you can see why you know we'll be taking it easy to deal with the uh, conditions of the road constantly changing on the road kill but look at these bends you know these are proper biker bends you gotta love it um, look at this sneaky camera van there, low lying sun, you can only just see the van, but he's definitely there. This is one of those, cue the music. Fuck the police coming straight from the underground, a young nigga got it back cause I'm brown. Morning constable, morning to you, sorry to disappoint you, oh yeah. So, you know, I'm not anti-police, despite that little bit of music there. Uh, genuinely aren't. You know, they do do a very good job. It's a thankless task in a lot of respects. You know, there's, uh, there is an argument. Speed cameras, are they just cash machines, cash generators? Here we are, entereth Helmsley. Gonna get ourselves pulled over in a second, bit of a regroup. Which is always good. See that sneaky camera van, eh? Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Here's the guys. Find a set of machines. Wow. So, who have we got? There's me. There's Matty. There's Speedy Joe, Phil, and Colin. And now we're just waiting for Chris and Jamie. Jamie, is it? J, Jason. Yeah. Sorry, dude, forgot your name. <laughs> You'd never mistake that, Chris. You'd never mistake that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit hair dryer esque. <laughs> that was quite a pleasant little stop. When you stop, you just got that unmistakable smell of hot engine, exhaust manifolds, and muddy water. <laughs> But hey, it's almost Christmas. We're actually, uh, this may turn out to be one of, if not the last, uh, motor vlogs that we do this year. Thimble Park, cabin in the woods. 
<laughs> speedy Joe's with us. So we left the others behind. But no Speedy Joe. Here they come. In you go boys, in you go. <laughs> nice one. That bike sounds lush. <laughs> <laughs> And as you can tell by the weather we've got today, it ain't no average shitty winter's day. You after a little bit, Leon? Just to say it. New Year's. What are your New Year's resolutions? Well, I tend not to make New Year's resolutions because I think they're a bag of bollocks. So yeah, just coming up on Scarborough Town here. What a beautiful day, what a view, what an absolutely stunning view this is. I don't know whether this guy thinks I'm a police bike, probably because of the rate that I caught him up after his overtakes, but he's certainly uh, not hooning anymore. So yes, my aims for 2016 is I want to uh, enlist the skills of my old mate Glenn at Ridercraft because I can't think of anybody better to do any form of uh, formal instruction in a safe and controlled environment um, and I want to learn how to wheelie, but wheelie properly in control, a wheelie wheelie good bit of a regroup for the 125s oh, I like that. <laughs> it's a nice bit of road that isn't it? Yeah. I love that bit of road across there, it's really nice. I couldn't hear a bloody thing. Yeah, that. that is so noisy, that bike. Yeah. <laughs> it's not really an exhaust, is it? It's just a pipe with a bit of oval steel around it. One day I just it uh, we've got a, a new rider out with us today, a big shout out to Jay, he's on his 125. Now you might be thinking, why on earth would you want to come out on a full day in the saddle with a 125 when you're all riding uh, relatively high powered bikes? Well, you know, biking buddies just shows you that it can happen. But at every point, every single person on this ride has made that lad feel welcome. Um, and it's brilliant. In essence, that's what it's all about. That's what it should be about. You know, we're all having a good ride. Jay's having a good ride. And he's a bloody good lad as well. You know, and it would have been such a shame had he missed the ride just because he felt that his bike wasn't suited to what we're doing. I smell the road, I can smell the leaf mould on the road. But that's the greasy shit you gotta be careful of. Some fine machines out with us today. And some very fine people riding them as well. No, you're dead right, like you can't not do a lap. It's only fitting, because this was the first ride of the year. You're right, it was. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Biking buddies does a lap. All of these leaves. Dear me, Guy Martin didn't suffer with that problem, I'm sure. Go on, Speedy Joe. This is where we're at. Oh, she's off. She really is off. Go, go, go. What an awesome way to end the year, uh. What an absolutely awesome way. Riding out with a bunch of mates, <laughs> just generally dicking about on Oliver's boat. <laughs> oh. 
awesome. I see what you mean about that debris on the top corner. Bloody hell, it's like going off road. Yeah, it's a swarm at the bottom as well, just got a little bit left. <laughs> you were flying down there, missus. Well, I might just have to have a couple of laps. Yeah, you've got to. But you... I see something with all the bikes. It gets very authentic. It does, yeah. And the noise. Yeah. <laughs> get, get a good bit of fire out the back there. Alright. Let's go for it. <laughs> Bloody hooligans! Go, Matty, go. And Matty's got the lead. Collins up the inside here. Hard on the brakes. Oh, I saw a car, bloody hell. Oh, can't quite take her yet. <laughs> We're talking of his shattered his pants. Nice one. <laughs> That's just getting well out of the way. I oh know I've got Colin on the inside. Thank you very much. Oliver's mount. Biking buddies and Matty has the lead. <laughs> what a cracking, cracking day. Go on, Colt. Round you go. Let's get a bit of filming of Colin. Colin's got the right idea. Take it out really wide. Going back through. Matty is the boy today. Totally photo bomb that. <laughs> Get out of the way! Get out of the way! I <laughs> know. Oh, uh, that bottom bit with the bumps is my favourite section. I flew down there. Here they are. The rest of the gang. <laughs> nice one, Phil. Speedy George, superb. Well, what an awesome stop that was. Brilliant bunch of people out today. Oliver's Mount, good, good laugh blatting around the track. Stopped in at the cafe there, had some fantastic food. Today is very, it just typifies what Biking Buddies is about. Just following Colin for a bit as we tumble down towards Whitby. Do you know, it's been an absolutely awesome day today. It's been utterly spectacular. One bit of it that I would change. Not the day, not the weather, certainly not the company. Which is pretty awesome, to say the least. Come on, Matty, through you go. And uh, when we rocked up at Oliver's Mount, Jo actually pointed out, she said, do you realise that the first ride that you organised this year uh, incorporated Oliver's Mount, and she's right, you know? How ironic is that? So, yeah, thanks for that one, Joe. So, uh, a little bit of a regroup here. Done and dusted for the day. Look at this. I'm not sure how this will uh, turn out on the lens, but I thought I would just throw the camera on. Just as a last minute thing. I'm looking at this through uh, tinted iridium visor and the sun looks absolutely phenomenal. Hey old Matty, you got that dicked over there son. Crank it boy. 
very cranky. Well, folks, what an absolutely awesome day out that was. Brilliant way to end the year. Fantastic company. Thank you very much to everybody who came along. I also want to give a big shout out to uh, my other mates who uh, worked with us today. Mike B. King, Neil, Jay the Stabbed Rat. Miss your company, guys. Hopefully we'll get to ride review uh, soon. Certainly uh, Mike and Neil, they've got their bikes off the road for the winter, preserving them, keeping them tip top. So we'll ride with you guys again in the spring. Jay, I'm sure we'll be turning wheels together fairly shortly. Definitely the right decision to do Scarborough. You can look out in front of us. We're actually looking west, um, directly across to the Pennines. That's where we would have been. And you can see, beyond a shadow of a doubt, the band of rain there. So I think we have just timed the day to the maximum where we've literally been chasing the sun all day. And we've had an absolutely top day. So uh, yes, thank you to everybody who's contributed to Biking Buddies on Facebook during 2015, who's joined me on ride outs, who's put up with my insufferable <laughs> ramblings and rantings. Thank you guys, it means an awful lot to me. We've had a brilliant year. I'm very, very much looking forward to 2016. I'm also looking forward to having the ability now, the motor vlog set up, to be able to share that with you guys that uh, take the time and effort to tune in and, and actually watch what we're up to. So yes, have the very best of Christmases. I hope you spend some quality time with friends, family, those that are near and dear to you. And I wish everybody all the very best for 2016. This will be the last motor vlog that I put together before the new year. So as I say again, a heartfelt thank you to everybody. As always, wherever you are in the world, whatever you're doing, keep it safe folks, keep it shiny side up, and we'll see you on the other side in 2016. Seven money horse pies, we can get down the block to girl stop Automatic static, better call a cop Spatch it, looking like she finna let me grab it I might have to snatch it, but I can't get it